Hello Hello everyone and welcome us. back to The Sims 4. Today in The Sims 4 we're going to do something that one of you guys suggested and I thought it was an amazing idea and that is make an evil twin version of Matt. So I'm going to open up the gallery here and there's going to be a bunch of uh, bunch of these for some reason. But we're going to grab, I called them Shingle Bottom after I changed the name because I like this name better. Shingle Bottom. We're going to merge, wait we didn't need to merge. We need to just throw them in there. It doesn't matter. We're getting rid of Sim 1. She's kind of cute, but whatever. She's gone. And we're getting rid of Jeremy because he's not involved in here either. And we're taking this guy and we're fucking with him. It's going to be the same guy. He's going to look pretty much the same. But he's going to have some messed up traits. He's going to have a deeper voice. He's going to have uh, a tough walk. Because obviously he's got to be tougher because he's a freaking evil twin. What does he want to be? He wants to be a deviant. Does he want to be a public enemy or a chief of mischief? A public enemy. That's what he wants to be. All right, so we're going to make this guy hot-headed. Insane. There you go. And we're also going to make him evil. Evil, insane, and hot-headed. And now to make him look evil. Okay, take those eyebrows. Tilt them down. There you go. That's all you got to do. And he's already looking kind of evil. Now, how, what else can we do here? What, how else can we make this guy look eviler? Can we make his eyebrows even more evil? Detail mode, there we go. Yeah, <laughs> look at that. Everyone knows that if you're evil, you've got to have an evil mustache. <laughs> there we go. An evil mustache. Look at this face. He looks like he's evil. He looks like he's half Hitler. If the mustache was a bit smaller, maybe. They don't have a Hitler must mustache right now. Still waiting on, on a mod for that. Okay, let's give him a blue shirt because he's, he's no, no, black. His black is an evil color. And we'll make his pants that color as well. Sure, that sounds good. For formal, he can't look identical to Matt. He's got he's to gotta make his own formal up. We got to change his glasses up. We got to give him different glasses. There we go. Some nice pedo glasses for him. He's kind of looking like a pedophile. He's not supposed to be a pedophile. He's supposed to be an evil, evil version of Matt. All right, I'm not going to mess with this too much. Oh, we got to, I know what we got to do with this guy. We got to make him more muscular. Oh. We gotta make him more muscular, and a, he's 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 an okay size. Let's let's change that back to what it was. But more muscular for sure, because when you're evil, you work out more, right? Because you because you want to beat the shit out of people. I don't know. It looks good to me. Let's go with that. Welcome, evil Matt. Wait, we have, we need to change your name. We can't we can't have this guy have the same name as the original Matt. We're gonna name him Mert. Merche. Oh, I guess we can just stick him in one of these houses here. We can't stick him in with the Wangs, can we? We could actually stick him in with a different family. That's weird. That's actually a really good idea. Any any weird characters I want to put in the game, I can actually just stick them all in the same house. We're gonna stick this guy in here in a furnished house, just 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 so he's in the town. Okay. All right, guys. All I'm gonna say is he looks evil enough to me, and I'm happy with that. Okay, everyone. Welcome back to the Shingle Bottom household. We're hanging out, obviously, once again with Matt and Jeremy. Matt is sleeping. And Jeremy is watching his big screen TV. Aren't you, Jeremy? Damn right you are. Whoa, whoa, he's on his phone now. What's he doing? He's browsing the web. You know, you could watch your porn on the big screen if you wanted. Matt's asleep upstairs. Watch channel romance. I guess that's the closest you're going to get. There you go, buddy. Oh, look at that. Somebody is getting freaky with a maid. Oh my gosh, Matt is feeling flirty and he now wants to woohoo with someone. It's time for a late night woohoo. Let's get over here. Come on. Okay, Patricia. I'm coming. Apparently I need to knock on your door first, but damn, this guy is feeling flirty. What are you doing? Sitting on the couch watching your TV as well? Get your ass over here. Oh, oh, I let myself in. Try for ba what? Oh shit. I just hit the try for baby button, but that's okay. If that's how I feel, that's what I'm going to do. Fruit Simba. Oh, Fruit Zumba? Fruit Zumba? Yes, we're Fruit zumba -ing. Okay, Fruit Zumba, get in here. Get into this bed. Oh, crap, the bed is too big. Don't mind me, guys. The hand of God is just uh, reaching in here for a minute. Gonna delete this toilet. Gonna take this bed. Gonna make it the right size. Going once, going twice. The bed is the right size. And your house is looking pretty damn huge right now. Maybe I should fix that up for you as well. You don't need four fridges. Sure, you need four fridges. You gotta feed a baby now. Okay, guys, I hope I didn't take to... What the hell? What the hell? This isn't... Jeremy? What? Jeremy is inside the house. And fucking evil Matt is out here. What the hell? I'm gonna give myself a rude introduction to him. Okay? No. No, I got a better idea. Oh, no, he's gone. Never mind. Never mind. Get back to the lovemaking. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't even tell him to do that. You guys are having a makeout session outside the house. Maybe if you, you know, went inside, knock on the door. I'm not going to go door and see if, see if Patricia's home. Huh? Hello, Patricia. Oh, oh, turns out she's home. Now we can try for a baby, right? Because we have a bed. There we go. There we go. Yeah, it's happening. I love how excited the Sims get. They're so enthusiastic about banging. And Matt decides, or Jeremy, sorry, decides to go in the bathroom to get to the bedroom, and she goes on in. And here we go. It is about to happen. Look at this. We are trying for a baby. I don't know if it's going to happen. This wasn't planned, guys. I wasn't planning on trying for a baby, but, you know, sometimes things happen. This is going to be one hell of an ugly baby if it's going to look anything like Patricia, guys. But that's okay. <laughs> it's, okay. it's Jeremy's a weird guy. She's a weird looking woman. It all works. And they're sleeping, and she's getting at... Trisha, you, you, you're at your own house. You don't need to get up and run away like, like you know, when you're at my house. All right. Well, I think Jeremy must be tired. Yeah, he is. It's the only thing that's yellow. He needs some sleep. I'm going to go home. No, shit. Wrong button. Go back to sleep. Damn it. I press don't go home, Jeremy. Don't, Jeremy. Don't do it. You bastard. You bastard. Go here. Go here. Don't. <sighs> Sometimes you just. I just don't understand these people. Oh, look, he's coming back now. Well, thank God. Okay, so apparently Matt has just been standing up on the sidewalk, just looking out that way. That's what he's been up to since I left. Great job, Matt. Why don't you go tell a successful joke? You have no one to tell a joke to because you have no friends. Matt, did you break the fridge? Did you seriously break the fridge? What in the hell? You better not electrocute yourself when you fix it, but, but you had to stop breaking things, okay? Can you please upgrade something so it's no longer breakable? Look, Amaya Wang is here. Just just bang her and then go back to what you're doing. Well, hey there, Amaya. Let me just walk through you on my way to come, come see you. Yeah, it's getting kind of awkward here, guys. <laughs> a little bit awkward. There we go. Get flirty. Oh, hey, Amaya. I know you just got here and you probably wanted to, you know, do something besides just screw like rabbits, but, uh, okay. Never mind. She was totally into it. Oh, that's the good stuff, that is. That's the good stuff. Oh, yeah. Now, Amaya, I know it's your natural instinct to get up and run away after you have sex with me, but ha! I'm gonna do it this time. I'm gonna be the guy who gets out of bed first. Deal with it. Well, I've decided I'm just gonna go fishing, because I wasn't even sure I could actually go fishing in this game. But look, you click on the sign, you can go fishing. You click here and you can't. That's logic for you. Look at these next-gen fish, guys. Did the other game have fish that actually moved around and shit? I don't recall. But look at this. You can go fishing with real fish. Holy shit, look at that one. That one's a big fish. I'm gonna go swim with them. Because I can. Hey, fishy, fishy, fishies. Don't worry, Matt. You're definitely gonna get a fish because I have a man on the inside, okay? And I know exactly what's going on with these fish. In order to get a fish, you gotta act like a fish. You gotta think like a fish. You gotta be a fish, okay? Look at that. What the? Did you see that? Did you guys just see that? Holy shit. What is going on here? Oh, all the fish are flying away. This is weird. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't you dare fly away on me. Don't do it. Don't do it. No. Oh, Jesus. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, I gotta stop. This is getting too much for me. Oh, stop fishing, Matt. This is weird. Meanwhile, as Matt contemplates his life next to the old fishing hole, Jeremy decides to continue writing Obama and Osama, a love story. How much has he done on that? Did he just finish writing that book? What's happening? Okay, it's hardly written at all. Keep it up. You'll get, you'll get there. Oh, isn't that sad? Matt just left for work. And then Amaya Wang comes over. That's okay. We'll let Jeremy satisfy you, Amaya. I'm gonna invite you in. Screw the book. It doesn't even matter now. Larkin Flova? What the? Jeremy? Jeremy? Amaya Wang is over here? Yeah, flaws it. Uh oh. Guys? I broke Jeremy. He can't move. Can you cook? Can you cook cr scrambled eggs, maybe? He still can't leave! Oh shit, he's stuck! The poor guy, he managed to lay this down here. Come on, Jeremy, you got this. This guy can't move. I could, I could, you know, maybe move the fridge or something, but this is funnier. The fact that Jeremy is stuck, eating a little bit of something out of the fridge, trying to go to sleep, can't go to sleep because he's stuck, Amaya's leaving, and I don't know, is he going to die? I really, I really wouldn't like it if Jeremy died. Matt? 
Tay. Matt, I'm glad you're home. Maybe you can save Jeremy's life. You, why don't you just scavenge that for parts real quick, just to make sure there's nothing important in there, because obviously it's more important that you get something out of this. And then throw this away, and then perhaps Jeremy won't die of starvation. Okay? Jeremy? Can, can you leave now? Thinking maybe maybe you might want to, like, leave? If you maybe, you know? Yes, yes, he's free! Thank God! Oh, that could have been bad. Well, hey, Matt. Sorry for walking in on you there. <laughs> Matt's just trying to take a shower, and Jeremy walks in, and he gets all freaked out about it. It's okay, Jeremy. You take 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 a shit anyway. Go ahead. Take a shit anyway. Oh, so close. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Do it. Go. Oh, okay. All right. He's afraid of a little booty, but Matt doesn't seem to care. Matt's just taking a shower. No regard for anyone. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, Jeremy. He just pissed himself. And now he's extra unhygienic. God, clean that up, you dirtbag. Can we get can we get a shower now? Can we get we can, okay. Oh shit. Oh shit, did you hear that noise? What the hell was that? Jeremy Jinglebottom is dying of embarrassment? No, 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 no! We can't let that happen! Go, 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 go! Matt! Jeremy just died of embarrassment! What the fuck? No! Stop cooking! Stop cooking! This isn't good! The Grim Reaper is here! Oh, crap. What does it say? One? Okay, here we go. Plead for Jeremy. Seduce into sparing Jeremy. <sighs> Oh, I gotta try it, guys. I gotta try and seduce him into sparing Jeremy. <laughs> I have a bowl of cereal in my hand. Matt, don't walk there. Come here, let me seduce you. Hey. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no. oh, that didn't work. Okay, okay. Try again. Try again. No. Oh, someone has already pleaded with the Grim Reaper recently. You can't kill Jeremy. You can't do it. He's my best friend. Okay, we're acquaintances, but still. Oh, Jesus. Okay, listen, get off your iPad, you jerk. Can we just maybe... You can't... Okay, since the sim is dying, we can't exactly go into build mode. Maybe we can revive him somehow. I don't know. We're gonna find out, I guess. Matt's... Matt is actually walking past you to take a dump. While you are figuring out how to bring Jeremy to the afterlife. What is this? Oh, God. No! No! Oh, shit! Just devoured Jeremy's soul. <laughs> you piece of shit. I'm gonna give you a flirty introduction. Hey, how's it going? Oh, it's gonna work? Oh, it worked. Okay. Flirty introduction worked. And now we're gonna have a nice chat. This has been a real strange day, guys. The Grim Reaper's kinda angry at the moment. I'm gonna try and calm him down. I don't know what he's so angry about. Oh look! We made the Grim Reaper happy by calming him down. Not, not now. What can we do? We can, we can debate game strategy together. I'm gonna ask him about his love life because I am still feeling flirty, honey. Because I took a steamy shower and I'm feeling steamy. Huh. Is he single? Is he single? Can anyone tell me if he's single? What just happened? What was that? The Grim Reaper is looking around. Uh oh. Okay, it's time for him to leave. Uh, I guess I guess he just couldn't handle all the sexiness that Matt was bringing along. Look at that. Look at that sexy face. He's kind of sad. Probably, nope, he's just uncomfortable, and he needs to go to sleep. You know, you could be, I don't know, mourning Jeremy's death. Jeremy just died. I would never intentionally kill that guy, but he died of embarrassment all of a sudden. How the hell did Jeremy just die of embarrassment? I really need to have sex right now to make myself feel better. I may have lost a good friend today, guys. But I still got my friend with benefits. Thanks, Amaya, for making me feel better. Alright, guys, well, I'm gonna end this video here. I'm really sad, obviously. I don't know if there's any way to bring Jeremy back. He was writing some great fan fictions, and then all of a sudden his life was gone. So, if you got any suggestions of how we're gonna fill that void in our life, you can go ahead and leave them in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you later. Goodbye.